Yeah, it's another winter storm day here in New Mexico. Let's get the latest on where the snow is with meteorologist Kristen Van Dyke. Good morning, Kristen. Good morning. Not much of a winter storm when it comes to the snow. We haven't seen a whole lot of it, but it is coming down. It is going to slow you down a little bit this morning. And later today, we are going to see those winds ramp up big time, which I think is going to be the bigger story this afternoon. But let's talk about the snow right now. As you head out the door up in the north, you are going to be dealing with some snow showers up in the northern part of the state. Uh, coming down in the Jemez Mountains, the Sangre de Cristo Mountains, still some on and off light snow. Snow in and around Santa Fe, but most of it in the higher terrain. And then for Albuquerque, we're all clear, but east of Albuquerque, Moriarty, Estancia, down toward Mountaineer, and even farther east out toward Vaughn, we're seeing some light snow. So those roads are going to be pretty tricky for you as well. Long I 40, too. And then down to the south and west, we have a few spotlight showers trying to make their way toward Magdalena, but those are really uh, fizzling on out as we get through the morning. Winter weather advisories now in effect just for the Sangre de Cristo Mountains with winter storm warnings in effect for the west slopes and the higher peaks there. Uh, that will go through noon today, so things are going to taper off as we head through the afternoon. For Albuquerque, 30s to start off with, partly sunny skies, only in the mid 40s for highs today, with really strong winds. So the wind warnings and advisories are well to the east. We're talking gusts near 60 miles an hour. I'll have more details on that coming up. Police say they've caught a firebug, and this morning he is waking up in jail. More now in your Monday morning news blitz. A man accused of breaking into cars and lighting them on fire is now behind bars. 20-year-old Aaron Carl Clark was arrested over the weekend and charged with auto burglary. Cops say at least six vehicles were burglarized and torched back in April. The victims of a weekend house fire are an Albuquerque firefighter and his family. Fire officials say the blaze broke out in the attic of firefighter Jason Baez's home. No one was hurt, but all of their belongings were destroyed. And there are about to be major headaches on Interstate 40. As of right now, I-40 east of Rio Puerto will be under construction for six miles. Crews are reconstructing the road. One side of the interstate will be closed at a time. The $12 million project is expected to wrap up in October. And pop star Whitney Houston has been laid to rest in New Jersey. On Saturday, family and friends gathered at a star-filled funeral in Newark to mourn her loss and celebrate her career. And those are your Monday morning headlines.